hi everyone so in today's video we'll be making this about a space so this article space we'll be making in the end yeah okay since i told that in next video we'll be talking about this article so we'll not be doing this we'll be doing this about us and then we'll be doing contact us space and then after that we'll be doing this con articles because uh, here we also need to deal with pagination and stops like that so okay here lara tips here it's the t is smaller so let us fix that yeah okay now if i click on this about so it is not taking me to anywhere yeah so we don't have that route defined so let us do that here in the router index so here is about yeah so let us create about view first so inside the views let us create about slash index dot view and let's say about now in this router let us uncomment this and here in the about we can say about slash index dot view yeah now if i go here so it is refreshing so you can see here we are seeing this about but we are not seeing the nav bar okay we are seeing the nav bar yeah we are seeing the nav bar but we don't have the hero section here so it is not showing like that okay now first of all let us go to this about index page here and let's just say hero so so in the about uh, about page contact us page will be adding one image so as you have seen my in first video there will be the image and it will have the text name as about so let's say about us here yeah okay now let us add another div here and we'll be just saying lorem let's say 50 words yeah so if i come here so it is currently looking like this okay now here in this above section let us add some content now we can see here div here yeah and we can add some image here now we can give here slash images slash now we can give here let's say image dash two dot jpg here we can say about here hmm let's see how does it look now so you can see here we are seeing this image which is very huge what we can do is we can give some class here and let's say height to be only 40 and in the larger screen so we can say height to be 64 units okay let me add this here let me remove this from here and let me here give class s dash full and w dash full and object cover now let's see how does it look like okay it's looking like this so currently we are seeing here this white taste is not seeing properly yeah we can add black color layer so let us let me make this as relative and let me give z dash zero so that it will be below this nav bar yeah so nav bar will be appear top and it will appear below so that's why i'm giving this z zero and now here what we can do is give a div and class here we can say absolute insert zero so top right bottom left all will be zero and bg black opacity will be 50 yeah so okay now it's looking good okay now let us add some text here okay now here let us add the title here yeah so what we can give it here is about us like this and we cannot see that because it is not saved yeah now also we cannot see that because it is appearing just below that so let us give some class here so that we can make it appear here so we can say absolute inset zero and we can say px test so let us see what happens when we do that so it is appearing here so you can see this about us is appearing here yeah 
so it is because this absolute spelling is wrong so now if i do it like this so you can see here now the about this is here so we want this to be visible over here okay now add it to the center here now what we can do is just make it a div and add it inside here we can give some classes here yeah and here in also we want container mx auto and then we want px to be 4 sm px to be 0 and we want text white and we want this h h full and w dash full so it will take the whole width and height so it is looking like this currently now we want this at the center so here so we can accomplish using flex 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 item center justify center now if i do this now you can see here it is coming at the center okay now let us also give some font size bigger to it we can say here 2 xl and we can say sm text let's give a use for our desktop size yeah let's see how it looks okay it's looking good but it's in the center it is not looking good here in the desktop view now let us look in our mobile view yeah okay in our mobile view it's looking good in the center but it's not looking that much great here yeah so now what we can do is here item center justify center what we can do here is sm justify in here and let us also give here flex dash call yeah uh, if we do it like this so it is coming here at the bottom so let us give some margin bottom so for this what we can do is we can wrap it inside a div and give margin bottom as 4 for the mobile devices and sm mb dash 8 for our yeah okay let us not give it for our mobile devices it will be not looking good yeah now it's looking good in the center and it's in little bit above the bottom okay it's looking good here so now if i let's say here yeah lorem 10 do like this and now if i come here so you can share this text is not at the center now what we can do here is text center and it will be at the center like this yeah so let us remove this now now you can see here we are seeing here about us like this okay i was doing that because same kind of things will be needed in here this articles page as well and there whenever we define a longer title then it will look like that so we'll fix that there because whenever the title is very long it is not looking good we'll make a little bit title a font size a little bit smaller there now we also want this to be just aligned yeah to this logo here like this now what we can do is here class container mx dash auto let me save first now you can see here now also let me give some paddings here right and py dash two. okay so it's looking like this and now in the mobile let me look how does it look okay so we need some padding so we have already done this kind of things before we can say here px test 4 and sm px test 0 yeah okay now it's looking good here and now if i go here in this so if we have only small content here so this footer is coming at the top so let's fix that so we can go that in the app yeah so it is like this so here is the top section and this is about us section and then this footer yeah three parts so okay let's do there class flex cool now it should not change anything yeah it is not changing anything here now what we can do here is add this inside a div here yeah and now if i give your class flex one it will span okay so 
So inside the flex, we have three items and it will span to fill the gap. Now, if I do it like this and refresh here, okay, it, it is not taking the full height because I don't think this div has the full height. So let us give the height as well, height as well full. Now, if I go here, now you can see here, it is taking the full height. Now, if I again remove this here, if we only have the height full, then also it will not work. Yeah, we need flex magic here. Okay. <laughs> now you can see here any, if we write any less content here, then also the footer will always be at the bottom. Okay, here, let me go to this about a space. Yeah. And okay, we have here P tag and let me add some more here and let me give here okay, let me remove this and let me give here class mt4 yeah yeah it's looking good okay whenever there are more content then it will look like this also we need uh, i want to add some gradient from here bottom to the top going yeah so here if i go and do it like this and we'll only change here like uh, pg gradient to top so the gradient will will go from top to top from bottom and we say from we say primary yeah so it will from primary to transparent from bottom to top and it will have some opacity here now if i do it like this so look at here it is looking a little bit cleaner yeah so this text are also popping because of this pg black opacity here 50 and this red is also giving some vibe to it okay we have completed this about us section in the next video we'll be looking into the contact us space and we'll be using the same thing here yeah this and we'll be extracting this into component and we'll be seeing how to do that if you like this kind of video then please don't forget that hit that subscribe button and also hit that like button i'll see you in the next one have a great day bye